Hello friends, today we are going to discuss Linux administration with Red Hat Enterprise Linux 7. In this video we are going to discuss about configuring the date and time in RHL 7. Modern operating system dis distinguishes between the following two types of clocks. Real time clock RTC and system clock. First of all a real time clock commonly referred to as a hardware clock typically an integrated circuit on the system board that is completely independent of the current status of operating system and run even when the computer is shut down the system clock also known as software clock that is maintained by the kernel and its initial value is based on real time clock once the system is booted and the system clock is in initialized the system clock is completely independent of the real time clock. Red Hat Enterprise Linux 7 offers three common command line tools that can be used to configure and display information about the system date and time. The time date control utility which is new in Red Hat Enterprise Linux 7 and it is part of system D. The traditional date command and the hardware clock utility for processing the hardware clock. So in this video we are going to discuss following topics using the time date control command in this topic we are go going to cover following topics displaying the current date and time changing the current date changing the current time changing the time zone and synchronizing the system clock with remote server and next uh, using the date command we are covering in this module displaying the current date and time changing the current date changing the current time and finally we go to using the hardware clock utility so let's begin with first topic using the time date control command the time date control utility is distribu distributed as a part of the system D system and service manager and allows you to review and change the configuration of the system clock you can use this tool to change the current date and time, set the time zone or enable automatic synchronize for the system clock with a remote server. Now go for next displaying the current date and time. To display the current date and time along with detailed information about the configuration of system and hardware clock, run the time date control command with no additional command line operation so I am going to show you here time date control command just type and enter and you can see here its local time universal time RTC time time zone NTP server enable and much more thing now next is changing the current date to change the current date type the following at a cell prompt as a root so first of all we need to log in as a root here I already log in as root but just I show you how can you logged in just sudo dash i and press enter type your password here and you can log in as a root now now type time date control set time and time format is 4 times y dash mm dash dd replace fourth time y digit with your four digit year mm with two digit month and dd with two digit days of the month i just set 2015-01-01 and press enter now check the current date so we use time date control command and press enter and you can see here local time 1 january 2015 now next is changing the current time to change the current time type the following at a cell prompt as a root we already log in as a root you can see here now type time date control set time and 12 hour 12 minute and 12 second and press enter now check the time again so time date control and press enter and you can see here it's time we successfully set the time by default system is configured to use UTC that means universal time to configure your system to maintain the clock in local time run the time date control command with set local dash RTC option as a root so time date control set local RTC and 
you can type yes or no here to configure your system to maintain a clock in a local time replace boolean with yes to configure the system to use UTC or replace boolean with no I just saw here yes and again control time date control command and you can see here one warning message you can see now next is changing the time zone to list all available time zone type the following command as a cell prompt time date list time zones and press enter it will show you all time zones available for your system just press Q to quiet to identify which time zone is closest to your present location for example to list all available time zone in Asia so we have to type time date control list time zone and we here filter with grab command and Asia and it will show you all time zone available nearby you for my location I have to change time zone to Asia Kolkata Asia Kolkata Kolkata Asia just copy that and time date control command and set time zone and paste your time zone here it will set we can also verify that time date control command and you can see here time zone is changed now next is synchronize the system clock with remote server as opposed to manual setup dis described in the previous session the time date control command also allow you to update automatically synchronize of your system clock with a remote server using NTP network transfer protocol to enable or disable this feature just type following at cell prompt as root so time date control set NTP and type here yes now just verify time date control and you can see here NTP enable now next is using date command the date utility is available in on all Linux system and allow you to display and configure the current date and time this is frequently used in scripts to display detailed information about system clock in custom format so let's display the current date and time run the date command with no additional command line operation so just type date and press enter and you can see here its date by default date command display the local time to display the time in UTC you can use dash u option with that so you can see here now its time in UTC you can also customize the format displaying information by provided the plus and format option on the command line you can see some supported control sequence on your screen to customize output of date command just type we have to run following command and press enter and you can see here now next is changing the current date to change the current date and ty type the following at cell prompt as root just type date plus percent f dash s small s and 2015-01-19 and press enter and you can successfully change the date you can verify just typing date command January 2015 now next is changing the current time to change the current time run the date command with dash dash set or only dash s option as a root so date plus percentage t dash s and 12 12 and you can see here now next is using hardware clock command SW clock is utility to processing the hardware clock hardware clock is independent for of the operation system you use and work even when the machine is shut down this program is used to find out the time from the from the hardware clock and set the system time about system time at boot time SW clock stores the value of year month date hour minute and second it is not able to neither store the time standard 
लोकल टाइम और कोऑर्डिनेटेड यूनिवर्सल टाइम नॉर्थ सेट द डे लाइट सेविंग टाइम इन रेडेट एंटरप्राइज लिनक्स सिक्स द एच डब्ल्यू क्लॉक कमांड वॉज रन ऑटोमेटिकली ऑन एवरी सिस्टम शट डाउन और रिबूट बट इट इज नॉट इन रेडेट एंटरप्राइज लिनक्स सेवन to display the current date and time of hardware clock we can use the sw clock command so i just type sw clock command and you can see here it's hardware clock time so that's all about configuring the date and time please subscribe and give your feedback to me and thanks for watching this video thank you so much